is yogi, brindar yogi. Beloved friends, I want to share with you very important aspects of life. Human being is very intelligent. Whatever their mind can conceive and believe, the minds are going to achieve for him. But there is a limitation. Mind think too much, but mind should also feel the pain, the agony, the sorrow, the suffering, and the torture because of the evil nature of the mind when it is saturated with negative mental attitude that is greed, anger, hatred, jealousy and cynicism then the mind becomes really very very dangerous I have experienced in my life I was always a very honest and sincere person honesty, integrity and humility has been my creed I am always striving, seeking and finding different ways and means to glorify my life so that I can render great service to the humanity. I developed kindness, compassion, perseverance, persistence, always guiding myself toward a definite purpose in life, always seeking the brains of different people so that united like coherent laser beam we can really deliver the best. But I tell you my some experience when I was in NMDC, I have already proven my worth by being always best. I have broken the records of two universities when I was a student of physics honors in Bihar University, which ultimately split in Mithila University and Bihar University. Nobody taught me, I taught my teachers. I was proven because it is simple, use your brain, you have intelligence. Work very hard, simply work very hard, full concentration, no diversion, neither looking nor, nor left. Focus, full passion to become something useful person. Then I also did the same thing in my MSc in Physics in Bihar University where the best teacher maybe in the whole world, Professor Vishwanath Rai, Professor Vishwanath Rai loved me and cared for me. He was one of the greatest quantum mechanics who has been also associated with Banaras Hindu University which is really a center of excellence in physics. Such great men loved me and cared for me. Even Professor Ghansam Singh, who was the HOD of the Department of Physics of PG, who has done himself PhD from Cambridge, London, they all love me because of my humility, simplicity, and my dedication and passion. Always studying. I never make any notes. I studied the whole books, A to Z. That's why sometimes I do not get a lot of marks because once you have completed so big, you know, the books, you don't know it really to confine your thoughts. Then Professor B. N. Rai told all the examiners who came that he's the best and they gave me the highest marks. Highest marks. And they never asked me any question. Because Professor B. N. Rai was such a powerful and such an honest and sincere man who will never tell a lie. I respect Honorable Professor B. N. Rai. I don't know whether he's alive or Maybe happy and healthy, I pray for him. Professor Ghansam Singh is no more. Dear Ghansam Prasad, I is no more, dear friends. Then I went to IIT, Kharagpur. There I did PhD. Again I joined the multidisciplinary subject of material science and engineering, physics being the main physics and meteorology department. There I didn't find any great professor who can really make me work very hard and do some research of the world standards. I saw the environment was very corrupt. People used to really copy somebody's thesis and uh, there were so many such people and they demanded from me without doing anything, a lot of publications. I was really a fish out of water because I was never dishonest. I never steal somebody's theory, somebody's work. But still I work very hard. I develop my own knowledge and talents. And based on that knowledge and talents, I was also invited for Mekon because Professor Achyana Acharya was a great man who really understood my dedication, my passion, my honesty, my simplicity and sincerity. He recommended me to join Mekon Ranchi. But meanwhile, my wife, Dr. Vandana Jha, joined Cosmoferrites, which was a ferrite industry, making soft ferrites for the electronic products in the inductors and transformers for switch mode power supply. There I went there and no sooner than better 
I become a very powerful man there because physics is my background and most important I have the brain whatever my mind conceive and believe the mind can achieve tremendous self lines tremendous self belief full measure of devotion dedication passion full concentration no divergence only concentration no scattering but full measure of penetration such a proven man when joined an mdc that is a very different company all people initially gave me lot of importance but after that they have no interest in real research or real establishing some new projects and plans they saw me talking very smartly they saw me my passion for cars they saw my so many divergent attitude towards sports and fitness they start criticizing me of course i tell you very honestly i was more of a bookworm than a practical man probably this was the thing that i cannot butter them i cannot touch their feet every time when they were abusing me because once they abuse me i really become subhashan bos bhagat singh chandsekar raja the reply them much stronger way because i was not ordinary but i lack that diplomacy that chanakya niti to be fool the great idiots and so they become so enemical they hurt me my heart was always bleeding bleeding like anything they never promoted me being a human being when all my colleagues are promoted and that morning i see that all are promoted they are distributing sweets and they come to give me sweets also i feel like a fish out of water and that not only water i was fried on the frying pan that was the agony i could not sleep my friends venkatesan he was the director of production mr n k nanda he was the junior most director he was very helpless and that s venkatesan has a group of people who joined together in mdc there was joshi who was the director personal and there was tyagrajan the black sheep all tamilians united together because i have talked very strongly to venkatesan s venkatesan when he was in charge for npd because nobody gave me chance they did not give you chance they don't give you chance to work no chance and when they left the project of new product development ferrite they abused me that i did not cooperate with me i told them the bad workman always calls me tools this man remember it because i don't fear man i am suvas bos i am suvas bos i challenged the british empire my friends were the most powerful people on earth hitler the great dictator ever born and the emperor of japan and italian you know how can i fear these insects these mosquitoes my head was always head high student of subhas bos rabina tagore vivekananda where the mind is without fear and head is held high my mind was always fearless dear friends but heart was beating bottom line i told you all these stories during the period of 30 years every time they denied my promotion even when i retire you know the directors were sometimes fighting on themselves somebody was bihari somebody was some other state uriya fellow they fought each other and they promoted their own people but when i was retiring also they didn't give me promotion i retired just as a manager during 30 years of service can you believe and the people who joined as executives that is junior officer they become general managers and they become executive directors this is everywhere is not only in mdc these are the mean minded people in the hall they don't have feelings they are machine people greed has poisoned the soul of such persons it has barricaded them from humanity they think too much they feel too less their power and positions has made them less feeling they are clever but they are unkind and unnatural people more than the power and positions they are blessed with they need to have the feelings 
you can believe there was one very good colleague of mine colleague of mine dubey ji very intelligent and strong man navin dubey he was very close to s bank station because they worked together in ultra pure ferric oxide plant in vijay i was so much upset once i planned to join politics and pull bank station from his seat in the director office of nmdc and slap him and lash him with cannon rods on the wrist that was the burning mind i sent a message to bank station bank station i can be so brutes and so dangerous i will rob you i will massacre your entire family because i was restless i could not sleep months together can you believe i was ordinary mortals today i am different i am less attached to these kind of external things because i have become a stoic saint yogi virendra yogi i know the meaning of life i living for every bird beast animal plants and humans but these people harassed me so much i have forgiven them they did not train me also i have learned and learned and learned but i did not learn the whole earth when i was made in charge for r&d of course because i was senior most i was sometime made in charge of r&d they did not make me participants in the different projects so i was not exactly knowing how to present my corporate planning they never train their subordinates they are jealous of their subordinates because they are not good leaders good leaders do not live for themselves they create the hierarchy much better and better people down the line so that if they are not there the country the company and everything survives and they enjoy from a distance they feel this is the company i have made like bill gates like you see the google my best friend pichai he was my junior in it kharagpur he joined in 89 when i have got my phd and and i went joined some other companies thank you viewers the bottom line think and feel in the proportion think growth think expanding galloping progressing towards realization of what the ideals but feel also mind only feel people say heart but heart doesn't feel heart only pumps blood to the different organs systems tissues i am alive i forgive all i forgive suresh chandra i forgive mr nanda and kinanda i forgive s bank station i forgive joseph josie i forgive the director finance who were 